What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Shane and this is Five Star Cards. I um, hope you're doing well wherever you are in the world and uh, you're being kept busy with all this crazy stuff that's going on. And uh, thanks for taking a few minutes out of your day to check out the video or the channel. Um, I hope uh, you like it and it'll burn away some boredom or some few minutes if you're sitting at home uh, self-isolating. Uh, here, look, we just chat about some of your favorite car YouTubers, like a podcast. We are going to be doing some some vlogs. Uh, we'll try and do some car reviews, something I'm working on. And we will definitely be doing a project car when we get monetized. And guys, when we get monetized, I'm going to show you the paycheck every month that this channel makes. And you're going to help me decide what project car to get, whether it's a crashed one or a non-crashed one. Um, you know, and what we do basically with the money every month, you know, what wheels we get and stuff like that. And where we travel to to check out, maybe link up with other uh, car YouTubers and stuff like that. So here's a question for you guys. I want you to comment below. Um... You know, when we get the um, when we get monetized, we start making money. What a what car would you want the channel to get as a project car? I, so I'm thinking like either an MK4 Supra, uh, maybe a crash Porsche Cayman, um, what else? Maybe uh, an Aston Martin uh, DB9, something like that. I, I mean, either we get one crashed uh, and lightly crashed, like front bumper damage or something like that, and put a body kit on it and go nuts, or we get one non-crashed where it won't take as long to you know, just start modifying straight away. So let me know even where you're from, comment below where you're from, um, stuff like that. You know, who's your favorite car YouTuber or comment below what you think. I think the budget's gonna be around 15 to 20,000 when we get monetized, if we start making enough money to, to do that. So, you know, get subscribing guys. We're smashing our way on up to a thousand subscribers and hopefully, you know, we can get monetized. Um, you know, I, we're, we're pretty far away, but we will get there. So thanks very much. Um, so yeah, like basically, guys uh when we get that done i'm going to be doing a giveaway uh lamborghini led sign or ferrari one whichever color you want and wherever you are in the world i'll send it to you or the other option is we can uh, get you some merch from your favorite car youtuber dd or tj hunt whoever it is a hat or t-shirt i'll buy it for you and send it to you when we get monetized and i'll let you know when we get monetized as well um also one last thing is it'll come up here i've made a website just a bit of fun guys where you can vote for 2020 car youtuber of the year at the end of the year i will release the results so get voting get on there get voting and let me know if you want me to add anybody to that list comment below and i'll add them to the list and one last thing on the site you can do if you want you can register an account and create trades on the form section so we can chat there about car youtubers and anything to do with cars as well uh, so I'm trying to make this an interesting like a bit of everything, you know, kind of channel So, uh, you know being in Ireland for the time being I'm just gonna be able to chat to you guys uh, About what's going on in the supercar community and once I start lining stuff up like cars to review or project cars stuff like that I will let you know and we will do it uh, So today's episode not too long only covering three channels today uh, very excited about one of them. So we're just going to be covering uh, Tavares released it on his channel day. He released the Car Trek uh, series with him, Ed Bolian and Hoovy. We're going to cover that. Uh, we're going to cover Chris Fick's latest video about detailing a $500 uh, kind of like SUV. And uh, one person we haven't covered on the channel yet, Alex Rebuilds. We're going to cover him. I started watching him today as well. So let's jump straight into it. Um, if this was the kind of stuff that you like, guys, check out my other um, other videos. Give them a like. You know, get get the channel up there. I want to give you the content you want. So please do um, please do help out. It means a lot to me. So first on our list, Tavares has released finally the Car Trek series has come out. Um, it was twenty minutes long. I watched on my my lunch break uh, and work, and I mean it was brilliant. I must say the. The good thing about it is it is done like a top gear program and uh, the way it's presented, uh, the three guys, they blend so well together. It is funny, um, the problems they've been, they had with each car and just the way it was shot as well was really well done. Um, you know, fair juice to the guys for coming out with this. This is what we need with everything that's going on in the world at the moment, you know, being stuck at home, this is going to be a great series to watch and it looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. So just to give you an example, here's a quick clip of the series that they've made. It 
It is a beautiful day in Central Florida, and I am driving my gated manual 2006 Lamborghini Gallardo Spider. What could honestly be any better than this? So what do you think, guys? Um, I think it's brilliant. Have you watched it yet? If you haven't, don't sleep in this. Go on to the Savaris channel. Definitely watch that uh, the series in the comment below and let me know what you thought of it. I mean, I thought, when I watched it, I thought Tavares had come out with the best deal with the V12 uh, Vantage. And, you know, but if I if I could have any of my top, if I could have any of those cars, I think for me, the Gallardo would be first, then the Ferrari, and then the, the SMR. Just, it's just the way I am. But even comment below, let me know which would you, which would you uh, pick in whatever order. Um, yeah, a lot of fun, and you know I'm not going to spoil it for you. Let you watch it, but yeah, some of, some of the things that came out there, they 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 got the estimates for each car, and I will admit, like Freddie's one was ridiculous, and I thought he was definitely not going to have the highest uh, estimate. So great series, I really uh, enjoyed it. Can't wait for the next ones. Um, you know that's going to really take off uh, for them uh, if they keep it up. A lot of people were really happy with that. Uh, so moving on to the next channel and our next person, the probably the the highest subscriber car YouTuber I think I'd say in the car YouTuber world, the supercar community is Chris Fix. He has over six million subscribers. I remember he was only like three million last year. The guy's double jumped, and I see why because he's so brilliant at what he does. Um, you know, like when this came out, I was waiting for because I wanted to see what he used. I'm gonna give this a go. He basically bought this SUV for five hundred dollars, fixed it up, um, and yeah, I mean, he did such a great job on it. Um, he really knows his stuff, and he really does give good tutorials. He links all the stuff below. Um, I am definitely, definitely gonna give this a shot with the compound, the polish, and the wax. Now, I have a crappy MK5, a 2005 MK5 three door Golf, but the headlights are very hazy on it, and I just. You know, with this whole self-isolation thing going on and, um, you know, nothing to do, I think it's something I want to do. So I might just, I might order the products in the next week or two uh, when I get paid next. And I might just do it. I might just give the car a buff, even though there's dents, a few dents all over. But just to show you guys, you know, uh, how it comes out and when Chris gave out the video. Um, but yeah, it was a great video. Very well knowledgeable. Glad I, got, I watched it. I was dying for that video when he said he was bringing it out. And um, the steps he does and he... The, tips and tricks he has like with the um, Avalon King um, you know protection he put it over the plastic that's a brilliant idea you know I, I didn't even think of that it's something I would even try you know because he said it so I've actually liked that video put it to my saves it's a very very handy one to uh, watch and another great video with Chris Fix so let me know what you think in the comments below guys do you love Chris Fix and did you watch the video and what did you think of it and will you actually try that yourself um, and the last but not least, a new channel I started with, not a new channel, he's been out a good while, but a new channel for me that I started watching is Alex Rebuilds. I have seen him before tipping away on the or the or uh, 8 that he bought, um, but then I just kind of drift away from because there's so much going on with other car YouTubers, but I've caught up on most stuff and I, there's nobody else really doing a lot of car rebuilds at the moment. Um, so I was like, thinking i was like oh yeah he he did a 720s yeah, so i'm on part three i need to go into part four next i'm going to watch it in a while uh, of him rebuilding the 720s and why wow, i the guy is brilliant i mean he really knows his stuff trying to get the car started um and the amount of work that's going to it and he gives you the prices how much it's costing you for parts and stuff it's insane but his channel does really well and you know i'm sure that's why he can afford to do the bits and pieces but a very i as i said i'm only in part three so um i'm really enjoying it so far i'm just going to keep probably watching it for the rest of the night uh if you haven't seen it and you're bored at home and need something to watch get on alex uh, rebuild's channel uh, it's amazing content, it's great to pass the time and I find it very interesting and I learn from as well, you know, it's good things to learn from and the amount of work he puts into it, so good content, definitely get on it and uh, yeah, well done to Alex Rebuilds. So that's everything I have for today guys, uh, just, you know, as I said, it's just a quick kind of round of what I watched today. Hopefully you have liked uh, the video. If you have, give it a thumbs up and watch my other videos. Let me know in the comments below if you want me to cover anybody else. And as again, again, we're just kind of chatting about your favorite supercar, uh, or favorite car YouTubers. So again, thanks very much. Um, I'm gonna head off. I will have a video out tomorrow. We'll see you then. Thank you very much for everyone in the world. Peace out and bye.